Hello, and welcome back to the Lego Cantina. This is actually this is actually a very exciting video for me because this is my first time recording on my new computer with my new gigantic monitor, which is amazing. And <clears throat> not only that, it is the first episode of the Neighborhood SMP, which I feel I want to say we're on like season three now. We started out a long time ago um, on a with the mod sauce mod pack, and that lasted for a while. And I got to record a little bit, but there were so many mod issues and stuff that we just we kind of just abandoned it. And then someone else brought it back, and then we brought it back again. Uh, but now we're back. And hopefully we're back for good. We're on a vanilla server this time, which makes things a whole lot easier. Uh, here we are at the spawn. Um, I've been on here a few times, just like to check it out, but I haven't done anything yet. I haven't even, like, I didn't contribute. I've helped build the spawn several times before, but I didn't contribute to this at all. Um, so, yeah, we're just going to, I mean... I don't know what we're gonna. We're just gonna start doing normal stuff, I guess. I gotta figure out where I want to build my base and all kinds of stuff like that. Just basically, we're just starting regular survival stuff right now. <clears throat> just as if we're starting a regular survival world. Got my first achievement. Well, my second achievement. First achievement was opening inventory. Um. So plans for this series, um, I have a very odd, kind of mildly busy life right now with school and I have a job, so I can't say I will have a consistent schedule, but hopefully, oh, there's a bad guy, hopefully I can actually do a decent bit of recording on the server and actually contribute to it a little bit. Um, alright, let's do some stuff here. Make that. Make that. Alright. I'm gonna go take out that creeper in two seconds. Make that. There we go. Onward to battle! Click. Click, click, click. I did it. Oh, do we have, like... I wonder if mob griefing is off. That would be nice. Alright, so while we're here, might as well do some basic stuff. Uh, do, 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 do. Eh, this, this is good enough for now. Uh, take this with me. I've heard people in the uh, group chat. Oh, I need, I'm going to need food eventually. I've heard people say in the group chat that this snow biome goes on for quite a while. So. I don't really know where or when I will start building a base, but I feel like for now, um, I think we're just going to travel, hopefully find some food now since I can't run. I think uh, generally I don't do a lot of editing. I mean, I've been doing a little bit more lately, but I feel like there's going to be a lot of editing in this video, just skipping out boring stuff like this where I'm walking very slowly. Um... So, yeah, I'm actually going to take a break. Ooh, what? Ooh, I d didn't want to do that. Well, at least I have a pickaxe with me. Um, I'll take this while I'm here. Yeah, I'm going to just sit around for a while, and hopefully when I get back, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a little break, and when I get back, hopefully something interesting will be happening. So, um... I'm gonna leave and I'm I'm gonna leave this cave and I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right. So as I'm exploring, um, still haven't found any food or anything, and I haven't actually gone that far from where I fell in the hole. I've actually found, oh my, <laughs> I've actually found this little little house thing. Is there any um indication of who this is? It doesn't really look like it. Let's explore for a little bit. This is actually very nice looking. Got an enchanting room. Stairs up to the next level. Wow, they've got big plans for this place. Wow. This looks actually 
Pretty nice. Look at this place. What's in here? Just nothing. Uh, over here, got some banners. Where does this go? Down in here. Oh, this is where that bridge was. This is very nice. Huh, that's, that's interesting. Alright. Hopefully. So yeah, there's no indication of whose house this is. Hopefully they won't mind if I borrow some food. Alright, so whoever this house is, sorry I killed one of your pigs. Um, I used my own coal though, so to to cook it at least, that's fine. So hopefully you don't mind. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go. <laughs> gonna keep exploring and hopefully in this episode we can find a decent place to actually set up a base. All right, so we're in a little bit of a um like a snowy forest now instead of the last area was just more like snowy nothingness. Um still not really where I want to set up my base, but hopefully this means soon we can get out of here and find a ooh, look at this. You find a good place to build a base? I don't know. Just playing it by ear right now, seeing what seeing what I find. Nothing interesting. Maybe if we get up to here we'll have a good vantage point and we can see something interesting. All I see that direction is more snow. What about this direction? More snow. This is of uh the people talking in the group chat did not lie. There this snow biome goes on for a very long time. So I'll talk to you guys again when something interesting happens. Alright, it looks like we might actually be leaving the snow forest biome soon. Just a little bit farther and then we will see what kind of an area we're in. It kind of just looks like maybe a very hilly biome. Uh, so let's let's climb up this mountain and see what it's like. And of course I am hungry again. <laughs> Alright, this, you know, this place actually doesn't look too shabby. Um... And there's a pig, so that's always a good sign. Source of food. Let me gather this coal while I'm here. Just one piece, that's fine. This is a very nice area, actually. Let me, uh, let's get up here. Oh, the sun is setting, that's always fun. You know, I like this area. This is very nice. I don't see any signs of life. So, I mean, means no one has claimed this area or anything. I think... This is actually where I'm going to have to uh, build my base. I like this area. So let's get... There's no really quick way we can get down, huh? Let's just get down from this mountain, make it across the water, and I guess make a temporary shelter until the next day when we can actually start doing some fun stuff. Alright, so sun is finally starting to rise over that way. We've got some skeletons around here which will hopefully start dying soon. I kind of just hid out in here. I've got a nice torch, a nice decorative mushroom. And I've been thinking about where specifically I want to build and what I want to build. And I think I kind of have no choice. I'm pretty sure I just have to build on this little island here. Have a bridge going back to the mainland. I think it would look really nice, actually. <clears throat> also, excuse my voice, by the way, if it sounds a little bit weird. I'm having, like, allergy issues or something. I don't know what's going on. Um, so up here, we can clear away some stuff. There's a zombie. Clear away some stuff. Um, flatten out enough room. Maybe we could have a bridge going over there, as well as one going over there. I don't know. There's, lo there's lots of possibilities with this place. I think it has... I think it has good building potential. So, I think what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to do a little bit of this carving out off camera as well as do a small bit of mining so I can pick up some stone, maybe some iron tools, um, and just like start to gather the resources that I will need in order to start building this house possibly this episode 
more likely next episode. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. All right. Um, just doing some mining when I fell down into this cave. So maybe we'll have a little bit of cave exploration. I wasn't really planning on this. I was just doing average mining down, just trying to get some stone and iron and that kind of stuff. Um, I don't really feel like doing a caving episode right now. Um, so I probably won't spend too much time on camera down here. I'll just gather up a few resources and then I can just head back up to the surface, get my tools, and then start gathering the necessary supplies to build this house, which I actually have to go on my single player world and find out exactly what that is. <clears throat> um, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Pretty much what I got back there was enough to get me these tools and there's a little bit more smelting back at the base a little temporary base thing I guess um so for now at least I'm kinda gonna just go off memory and collect what I think I will need for this house and then later I will go and check what I actually need mostly it's a lot of wood and cobblestone uh, mostly wood and cobblestone kinda stuff pretty basic colors um, then once I have huge amounts of all of those things then I will go on the on my single-player world and kinda like check the specifics to see um, what kind of other stuff I will need I'm thinking I'm, I'm kinda thinking that will be saved for another date or for another episode just because of time I don't want to be and I don't want to be like pushing too much stuff into one episode I don't know I don't know what I'm doing it's raining so that's always nice um hope that won't be too loud or anything and he's gone thief lord he's a guy from the original oh my he's a guy from the original neighborhood he's a pretty cool guy uh if I remember I will put his link in the description Hopefully I can get a list of everyone to put in the description. Um, I'm not finding what I'm looking for. Which means I should just take all these down. The base as of right now is still just that little cave and a couple chests and stuff set up. Crafting table, furnace, the basics. Um, and it's probably just going to stay that way until we start building the real house just because there's no point in building a secondary house that I'll only use for a little bit. Might as well just stay in a little mud hut until I have the full thing. Um, I don't like being out here in the rain with all these mobs, so I'm going to head back to base. Um, what I do need to find is sheep, because for now I kind of have to just deal with waiting the night out. And since I'm the only one on right now, I could potentially... Oh my... I've never seen that happen. I knew, I vaguely knew that happened, but I've never seen it before. <laughs> um, let's get rid of some useless stuff. Oh, I need these. Let's set up, just for right now, let's set up a little tree farm. That's not what I want. Just so we can get some stuff going. Instead of having to explore for trees, I can just get them right here. Um, we'll leave that for now. Don't really need to light up that area since I won't be there, at least for a little bit. Um, get that, put those in there. So I think pretty much, um, just the same thing. I will see you guys either in the morning or when the rain clears up. And we can start doing some stuff. Kind of on a, oh kind of on a quest to not die right now and kind of on a quest to find some sheep uh, kind of on a quest to say hi to this guy um, I, I believe he's a newer member like he's not oh and he's gone <laughs> um, I really want to find some sheep because then I wouldn't be having this problem of running away from monsters I could just be d oh wait what's this 
Has someone been here already? Oh, go away. Ooh, an iron ingot. Thank you. What's this? Who's this? Someone's just got this little fenced off cave. Is there a, uh, is there a base nearby? I don't see one. All I see is just that little cave thing. Huh. There's a creeper up there. Very interesting. Can I get back out? I definitely can. Oh, uh, let's just let this guy get in here. I wonder who set this up. Am I going to have a neighbor? Alright. So, um, really don't want to get lost. I'm pretty sure my base is back that way. I just really want to find a sheep, and I thought I saw one over here earlier. No? Hmm. I don't want to go too far. Hmm. Let's go back this way. Maybe there's more chance of finding one in the snowy biome? I don't know. I'm not one of those, like, technical Minecraft gamers that knows all the specifics of how everything works. Oh, it's much quieter here. Um, I just kind of derp around and do stupid stuff. I do a lot of building, uh, as you guys probably know. But for the most part, like, I don't know what I'm doing, for the most part. I still don't see any sheep. Very disappointing. I see a creeper. I see lightning. I think we're just going to have to wait for daytime the normal way again. Worry about getting a bed at another point in time. Back in the noisy rain. Alright, I'll see you guys later. <gasps> oh man, look, 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 look. Oh yes, this is perfect. Over here, we have a sheep, a cow, and don't really care about the cow. What I care about is the sheep over here. And wait, do I actually, um, do I have, I do have iron on me. Perfect. Now I don't even have to kill it. Come here, you. How many is that? Three, three pieces. Oh, you're kidding me. That's awesome. Didn't have to get lost looking for it. Didn't have to wait forever to find one. It's right here across my little stream thing. Which I should totally build like some boats or something in here at some point. Oh, in the few Oh, yeah, that's a creeper. Can I get him from here? Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, no. He was too smart. I'm so bad at fighting. Ooh. There we go. Alright, so he's out of the way. These guys are fine. Alright. Crisis averted. Got some more saplings we can throw down here. Um, Alright, so now we have that. Let's just go ahead and make the bed right now. And then we don't have to deal with... It's already daytime, so I can't sleep now. But at least for the future, we won't have to deal with any more nights with bad guys and that kind of stuff. That's... Oh, my. Look at that glitch. Um... That's awesome. That's really nice that we have that now. Um, so, still for now, it's kind of just more of the same. Um, grinding away at the tree farm. Um, kind of just doing basic boring stuff that no one really needs to see. Should do something there as well. Maybe like a big tower. I don't know. All in the future. Still need to worry about getting a house right now. Don't need to be worrying about towers. You know, I could, um... 
I don't know if I want to straight ahead try to design some sort of bridge or if I want to just build something temporary so I can get over there. I don't see any harm in des trying to design something nice. So let's take let's take this cobblestone, turn it into slabs. Okay, and let's get over there. I want it. I think I want it connected like right there. So let's get up there and see what we can do. <clears throat> This way we won't have to deal with this climbing every time we need to get up there. Okay. Yeah, so somewhere around here, maybe I want to have like it a little bit lower, so like right here is where it would start. And I'm thinking maybe we want to do something like this, like this, like this. Okay, so, oh, finally stopped raining, that's nice. So this will be the start. The actual bridge will be made out of cobblestone, and the um, supports or whatever will be made out of wood. And we do like two blocks and then a height difference. So let's try to go straight this way and get it started on this side. So this is the middle. Do this, do this, and then like that. So somehow those two sides will be connected. Um, and that will be our mode of transportation from one side of the mainland to the house on the the house on the hill um, yeah that'll be very nice if we can get something nice looking there something that looks good from the side and is still functional you know so I'm gonna I'm going to get started on building this bridge, and I'll see you guys in a little bit again. Alright, so let's see. Off camera, I started this farm, which will take a long time to fill up probably, but at least that'll be a good... Blah, blah, blah. At least that'll be a good deal of uh, food coming in from this kind of area. Um, this little top area is going to be wheat just because and there's going to be several trees just to make it look nice um, then this layer will be potatoes and then maybe this lower air area will be carrots I don't know we'll see what happens uh, so that's got started that's just right up here from this area this is where I kind of where I've started I got the little cave over here tree farm going which is nice um, and then over here I really hate this bridge but it's just a temporary thing for now um, I have started building the house. It's going to be very small, um, but the catch is you go into the middle and dig down, and the whole most of it is underground. And so you just have a nice, cute little house on the top, and maybe I'll build another one over here, all over the place, just to make it look like a little village. And then, um, <clears throat> so all they'll all be these little houses with caves underneath them, and I can probably make them all connected, which would be really nice. Um, so, that's pretty much a progress report for what I've been doing this whole time. Um, I took a break, I had to do a math test, so that took a lot of time. Um, but yeah, not much, not much else has happened. Um, so, house, tree farm, regular farm. I feel like, I don't know how long of a video this is going to be, but I feel like for a first episode that's a pretty good start um, I need food I should have a, a piece of steak smelting though so that's good um, so once the farm is set up then we'll definitely be we'll have taken care of the whole food issue 
and I won't have to keep slaughtering everything I see. I do have a beautiful farm down here. So once that grows, we'll have a huge crop income from here. Um, I think that's pretty much it. Let me hop back up here. So, hopefully you guys enjoy this new series. It is awesome to be back uh, in the swing of recording gameplay again. Um, considering I've been wanting to do it for so long. So, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, share this video with your cat and get your cat to subscribe. If you don't have a cat, well then share this with your dog, your hamster, your goldfish. Although I wouldn't recommend putting your phone or computer inside the goldfish's tank because that wouldn't really be a good idea. I mean, your, your device, but I wouldn't recommend it. Beautiful house in here for now. You've already seen that for the most part. I did get a bed, which is awesome. I was able to... Was that on camera? I don't even know. But, yeah. Have a bed. Off to an okay start. Pretty good start, I guess. I don't know. I'm going to stop drawing out this intro, and I will see you guys all later. <laughs> Like, yeah, I know, sometimes you get coins, but...